So wearing out the joints is a natural uh, uh, degenerative process associated with age. Of course, there are other factors that can accelerate this, such as previous injuries in younger days, uh, the body weight, the nature of your work and habits, and then of course, lastly, genetic. But with time, most, all, most people will have some degeneration in the joints. Uh, it's a matter of the severity and the impact on their lifestyle that makes them decide whether they need uh, uh, treatment. When we assess the patient, we basically the principles of managing uh, patients with severe arthritis in the knee uh, will be two, two types of approach. If the patient is uh, fit, healthy, outgoing, likes to maintain an active lifestyle even into a very old age, then we will usually suggest surgery to correct the deformity and uh, solve the problem at, at its source. Convert, and that will entail knee replacement surgery. Now conversely, if the patient is sick, has a lot of medical issues, or is a very sedentary patient and hardly goes out, then obviously uh, surgery may not be an option. And this is patients, then we focus more on pain management. It means we're not solving the problem, but we're just trying to help the patient suppress the pain. And this may then entail the use of painkillers, walking stick, physiotherapy, uh, braces and so forth to manage the condition. For patients who are 60 years and above, we can quite confidently predict that the knee will last them their lifetime. The average lifespan of a Singaporean was around 80 to 82 years old. So the chance of the implant uh, lasting 20 years is extremely good. In the younger patients who sometimes present to us for uh, knee replacement surgery, then it's important that we advise them to, uh, to, be, uh, to have a, so avoid high impact activities after the knee replacement is done, so as to ensure that the implant will last in their lifetime. As a rule of thumb, the wear rate of the knee replacement is 1% per year. That means to say that if you ask me 10 years down the road, what is the chance that I need to replace that knee, then it will be 10%. And 20 years down the road, it will be 20%.